Hello and welcome to a quick mail call on the channel. As you can hear from my voice, I'm still sick, uh, but I received mail. Big box! Really excited, got that from the uh, UK, from a great friend from the Peak Arrow. So do me a big favor, head over to the UK, search this guy out, not me, picture on screen. Well, not that guy, also picture on the screen. And hug them and say thank you, cry to send you. <laughs> uh, jokes aside. Um, pictures I just shown was Mark Spark and the Peaky Arrow. All great guys, uh, great friends from the UK. Um, hit up their channels, uh, leave a like, uh, check out their content, leave a sub if you don't have, say uh, Crydo sent you. Awesome people, um, they do uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, also, I have a ton of other friends, Traveling Power is friend. Dark like in 81, Shadow Wiz, a lot of friends, just check my recommendations on the main page, check the video description, um, awesome people. Uh, that out of the way, uh, I want to do a bit quicker than usual because as I said I'm sick. Um, also keep an eye on the channel, I got this, mailbox, uh, mailbox, unmailboxing whatever, unboxing coming soon, same with this, uh, Asper had a had a like sale they do in the EU and the UK and advent calendar so each day a different brand gets like 40% 50% off and well I didn't want the power lens I think it's awesome and I'm in the unboxing I will tell you exactly how and why I got it so as I said that aside uh, big box from the big arrow um, stuff all really cool bubble wrap, more stuff, and more stuff, and even more stuff, and way more stuff. Oh god damn it! Eh. Oh, and way 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 more stuff. Give me a sec. Sorry for the noise. Another box, a box in the box, a peaky box. Uh, this is also from the UK, but I actually bought that on eBay on Co UK. And yeah, well, let it ship to the peaky arrow to um, to get it shipped to me because it was UK based. I actually bought it off Mark Spark, and he like, when do you say anything? Get it for free. I'm like, dude, you need the money, so why should I? Uh, do like yeah, your favor and good and it was rather cheap so it was like five bucks or ten I don't know with, with free shipping so fine um, I'll, and if you get this or want the, to get these like these I m missed these uh, blu-rays in in my collection so far if you want to get this in Germany this is freaking expensive over here I, I don't know what what is with this country I, don't get me wrong, we as the Germans, we, we yell enough and, and we complain enough about stuff which is here and which is wrong. Our, our country is great so far, but some stuff when you want like collectibles like Power Rangers, Marvel, DC, doesn't matter. This is fucking crazy here. I don't know why. Um, speaking of fucking crazy, um, I'm happy that I got this. Um, have to unbubble wrap it. Give me a sec or two. Sorry for the noise. I keep it away from the uh, from the microphone. Ah. Junk. Clean it up later. Um, this is Japan toy, but also from the UK. Um, this is one of the things I like. I wanted this. Um, you collect these swords like I did. So, and you're a fan of Ninja Storm, and you actually want Ultra Zord. You need this. I'm still missing the Thunder Zord from this season to actually combine it with the uh, Storm Helicopter and with the Storm Megazord. Um, I think Storm Helicopter, I think that's not the right term, but you'll know what I get from the from the sixth range from the Green Samurai Rangers Zord and the, the main, the Storm Megazord combines with the other through from the Thunder Rangers which forms the Ultra Zord, you need this. And either you get it through, yeah, EU, American, whatever toys, or you get this Japan bundle that's compatible. Um, we'll unbox that later on the channel as well, but 
that will take a while because I need the the stone megazord to actually do ultra sword. So that aside, um, where did I put that? Put it there. Um, the other stuff I got is actually a present from the Pinky Arrow. Uh, my birthday was way back in July this year, and he said like, eh. This is for you. I got you covered. I'm like, dude, that's way too expensive. I'm like, nah, I want to do that. So he gifted me Wild Force Conga Zord, which is crazy expensive. Here's one of the Zords. Here's another Zord. And <laughs> good that it's bubble wrap. Shit. Give me a sec. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. I hope it's not broken. I would cry. One sec, or two. Bubble wrap, lifesaver. Um, so this is, yeah, the the bull or what it's called. No. Uh, and you're asking, okay, that's the that's the Kongazord. What's that? Well, that's the Isis Megazord. Uh, you shouldn't really call it that. I mean, in the past it was way common with, with all that terrorist organization and stuff, but uh, nowadays, well, it has that name. What do you want to say, no? It's it's the ISIS Megazord. Um, he said, I got that on eBay. Here's an extra. Have fun. I'm like, what, dude? No. It's like, yes, yes, I want to. Uh, we exchange stuff now and then. I'm really grateful, Chris, for giving me all this. Uh, I know I cannot even even that out but I will try somehow um, I will unwrap this because this is much do a quick cut and we see us afterwards so in a bit I'll be back with Zords so I'm back after I don't know how long I cut this out afterwards and post uh, because it took a while um, this stays bubble wrapped this is an extra Wild Force Falcon Zord, not to mistake him with the Falcon Zord from Season 3. Um, I bought one recently on eBay, as you can see in the other mail calls, and this thing is huge, and I love it. But this one is a double, which goes to a good friend of mine, to the chat with, as a present. So it's uh, like blessed with the Peaky Arrow. He's fine with that, so this stays like it is, it goes into the box. It's a similar deal as you can see here, this is mine. Also this little amadillo here was not in the box, because I had that already from Mark Spark as a present way back, also seen in a mail call. Um, this guy is huge, as you can see. Um, the amadillo belongs in here somewhere, I didn't, I wanted to show this so that I didn't actually put him in there. If something's out of place, not really correctly transformed, way sorry for that. I didn't see Wild Force in a while, and <laughs> I never owned this horse before. So I don't actually know, I think this is correct. I might be wrong on some angles and combinations here. Um, the Wild Force Isis Megazord is also, is like, this one is the Fulton Zord. Then you have the Spare of Pedolis, which is a giraffe. Oops. Don't crash, please. It, this guy's massive. And here's a deer, and a rhino, and the amadillo. Which is, yeah. Um, I will give it a spin. This one is the conga sword. Um, we'll explain it in a sec. Um, this is my, well, birthday present from the Peaky Arrow. Uh, as you can see, he dropped. But he was bubble wrapped really good. So sorry for that. That was not on purpose, of course. Uh, I love my swords, as you can see, and yeah, never happened in the past. I'm like, I I'm too excited for this. Uh, this is one of those swords which I'm really missing. Wait, 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 stop, stop, stop. Can we get the little guy in here? Can we get you in here? I think I have to make a ball out of you, right? To actually put you in there. I, I love this little, <laughs> I love this little dude. Um. I think he needs. He, he can. He, in, the, in the show, he's being shut out. As I said, I didn't have this swords. I mean, I have this a while now, but I never actually combined it like that. 
Yeah, snaps in here, kind of. And as you can see, this guy is like, eh, don't lean over. This this guy is massive. He's heavy and uh, not much missing from Wild Force. It's one one of the season like you never get that like that fast because Wild Force swords are like kind of spread out, but still pretty expensive and rare, at least in good condition. I'm missing the Animus Megazord, which is basically repaint of the main Megazord, and um, I'm missing a part for the Pegasus Megazord, which is basically the red line in huge. I've seen that on eBay, eyeballing it, price is 120-ish, we'll see if I can get a better one, like quality or like price-wise at least, uh, which fits for my liking, and I think... I'm almost done with that then. I cannot... Oh yeah, the one of the swords I almost forgot and love. And I think he was light on. <laughs> yeah, he was light on. Which I really, really want is the Predator Sword from, uh, from the Wolf Ranger. That thing is cool as hell. Um, I need that one. And then that's Wild Force for my, for my shelf, which is really cool. And I have to say, besides this guy which is amazing and well the Congo Zord which is really great I, I, I love I love the Congo Zord I always like the aesthetic and then I have to clean the swords up a bit because the second hand they're used but that's normal for those guys they're great great shape and um, the um, Predator Zord was one of my favorites so far from most the seasons the Wild War Swords in general are great swords the the aesthetics the, the looks of everything as I said um, Downside on this is you kind of need. Oh wait! Quick cut. Be right back. Sorry, <laughs> uh, I I didn't want it that my daughter pops in. Um, I have family, as you might know if you do know the channel, but I don't want my kids on cam. No, uh, that doesn't need to be. If they are old enough and they want to do YouTube yourself, fine. But nah, not at the moment. Um, distraction aside, um. As I said, I like the aesthetics of those swords. Um, they look look really amazing. I'm really, really grateful for the Peaky Arrow because what I want to say is he helped me out with completing my Wild Force Megazord. Well, basically, 90%, 80-90% of my Wild Force swords I got from the Peaky Arrow. So, shout out to the guy again, um, to all my friends. As I said earlier, check out their channels. They're on the recommendations on the main page. Keep an eye on the channel. Keep notified, subbed if you don't have already. And... Content coming as always, let's play as regulars, German and English, if I have some English projects planned for the future, of course, and unboxings and stuff in English as well, like reviews and so. Uh, thank you for watching, stay safe, get healthy, stay healthy, I do my best, and till next time.